Hello everyone. I, I'm a bit late with the video of this week. I've had a situation this morning with one of my wolves. I'm still waiting for the vet to come and dart him. So I'm sitting on my bed here with him. There's Ben. We're waiting. I'm just keeping him calm. Um, so yeah, um, the angels came to me, Archangel Gabriel came to tell me what the energy of this week is about. And it's all about empowerment and disempowerment and how we allow that. So the card I drew from my angel cards, my Asta angel cards, is Naftali and inner power. So that coordinates with Gabriel's message as well. So... The angels want to really help us this week to empower ourselves. So for that, you must be aware of everything that makes you feel disempowered. Like I am now with, with Finn and this situation. He's got something stuck in his jaw and I can't get it out on my own. So that can make us really feel disempowered. It's all still part of this chaos and everything that's making us feel the victim so this week it's all about empowerment and disempowerment and how we allow ourselves to feel empowered within a situation so look at all the ways where you allow disempowerment where you allow people or situations to to make you feel disempowered disempowered and ask yourself whether that is really your truth whether there isn't anything you can do to help yourself to feel empowered within this situation. So that's what I did this morning. Also last week with the kittens I picked up that made me feel very vulnerable and that I didn't know what to do and where do I find owners for them. And I just visualized giving the kittens and their mommy over to the creator, to spirit, and they all found homes. The mommy is in to be sterilized today. She goes to a home, a very good home in Pretoria. On Saturday, the last kitten has found a home. She's going with me to Joburg on, on Thursday to take her home. So, and this thing with Finn as well, we can go into that which is most difficult, that which we cannot control, or we can allow ourselves to ask for guidance. And I always ask for the peace to come over me, to allow me to know, to forget that feeling, that knowing. So I've got people that I talk to that I ask for this help, the angels, and always when it's something to do with my animals, I, I, I ask my dad that's passed over. And this morning, I asked my dad to just help me to be calm and to know what to do. And um, my vet doesn't usually come out. So I knew there was no way I would be able to get Finn in the car. And take him to the vet because he's very wild and um, so I knew I had to ask one of my yoga ladies for her vet's number because she's got horses get somebody that will come out and that immediately empowered me so first we need to get away from that feeling of disempowerment and just center yourself become calm ask yourself what do I need to do and ask spirit to show you, to give you the guidance, the knowing and the calm to help you to be able to function with that. So this is a week to really focus on doing, get the things done that's disempowering you. Also, if we don't focus on what we need to do, we tend to become disempowered because we're stressed about not doing it and not wanting to do it or whatever is keeping us from it. So, this is a week where you need, really need to allow spirit to bring you the guidance, the knowing, the ideas comes to us. So just allow that so that you can feel more empowered and just get these things done so that you can feel less stressed and less in the victim. So remember, ask the angels to help you and sending you lots of love. And I'll be grateful for all the healing energy that come Fen's way. Um, thank you for everybody, all my clients and everybody that has stood with me. And thank you for all the new subscribers. I'm so grateful that everybody looks forward to my messages every week. And I'm so glad that you allow the angels 
to empower you every week with their guidance. So stay strong within yourself, but keep giving it over. Keep surrendering. Don't try and control it. Wait to receive the answer as to know what to do and how to take action before you just take action or think that you need to control it yourself. I'm sending you all lots of love. Take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye guys.